Childbirth is a joyous event, but for women in poor countries, it is also a dangerous event. Every two minutes, a mother dies from childbirth complications, often leaving behind a young family and often in the prime of her life. We know why these mothers die. The three commonest killers of mothers during childbirth are bleeding after childbirth, high blood pressure complications, and sepsis. Here at the University of Birmingham, we are tackling two of these three killers, bleeding after childbirth and sepsis. Bleeding occurs when the womb, the uterus, does not contract. There are drugs that can contract the uterus and stop the bleeding, but these drugs need to be kept in a fridge, otherwise they become ineffective. However, access to electricity and refrigeration is limited in many poor countries. So we are working on a heat-stable version of the drug, which does not need to be kept in a fridge. This drug, if it's proven to be effective, it will save thousands of lives. The second challenge that we are tackling is sepsis. Sepsis is a life-threatening infection that results in the bodily organs failing. Timely recognition and treatment are essential to save mothers' lives. Dr. David Lissauer and our team is developing a bundle of care in partnership with the World Health Organization to ensure timely treatment is given to the right patient at the right time. We are fortunate to work with partners who have allowed us to pursue a strong agenda, particularly the charity I'm Alive, the World Health Organization and the Birmingham Women's and Children's Hospital. We are really grateful for the strong commitment that has been given by the University of Birmingham in allowing us to pursue this agenda, and we invite you to find out how you can play a part in averting this tragedy.